Read it. Hello, I'm Joe Phonium. My name is Joe, and I play the Euphonium. Welcome back for another reaction, where I share my thoughts and feelings as a musician to a piece of media that deals with music and musicians. This is Nodami Cantabile, episode 15. And where we last left it, Nodami and Chiaki traveled back to meet some of Chiaki's family members and got a little insight into the background that he came from. And yeah, it seems all is not well, particularly with, like, with the uncle, like really wanted to push him into the company or otherwise just not having faith in Chiaki's musical prospects and then the whole thing about they used to drug him to try to get him on a plane. Um, yeah, I mean, we, we know about Chiaki's fear of flying but and this is coming up more and more often so it's got to be resolved eventually especially now that multiple people have pointed out that if he wants to see his career in music he's going to need to be doing things outside of Japan. And yeah, we'll see what comes of this. Let's go. Oh yeah, Chiaki's the violin, yeah. It's Elgar's violin sonata. Elgar? You sure? I know his pomp and circumstance marches, and salute d'amour, his cello concerto and the dream of the Oh, okay, at least he's named others beyond pomp and circumstance. And three, as well as his introduction and allegro for string quartet and orchestra, but not this piece. Huh? You know, just named like half the repertoire there, but. Uh... Find it strange I know some things? <laughs> he told me that because Elgar composed his pomp and circumstance marches during a time of war, there was a period in his life when he was yeah, a little too patriotic. Little known fact, yeah, that. Turned on him. His compositional style was thought to be ultra conservative and conventional. Pomp and circumstance, yeah, is it not a totally Sometimes ceremonial happy thing? <laughs> About soldiers going off to war. Would rather talk about cricket and horse racing. It's a really good performance and very dramatic. He's playing um, the violin part very dramatically, and I don't know the piece well enough to know if he's uh, having. Place, just like usual. Yeah, I was gonna say if Nodame's performance is accurate to the score or not. Probably not. It doesn't. It, to my ears, it still sounds good. It's still coming off well. He's definitely being the glue to hold it together there. His great playing. Uh, yes, you're right. And you can go after what you want as well. I'm just hoping that what you want is the Miyoshi Company. <laughs> we were close. I was going to say, that resolved really quickly. Wait a second, Shinichi. How about trying dolphin therapy? I heard it's what? very successful. Maybe for the dolphin. <laughs> I have a better idea. I'd appreciate it if you pay my tuition and renew my apartment lease. Uh, no, that, that's... No that, that's good. Uncle Shin, your violin playing is starting to sound a little rusty. <laughs> Study to oh. be a conductor may be important, but don't waste the talent you have on the violin That's either. nice that he's getting the fire back in there without, you know, standards of playing. <laughs> I will, I promise. It's nice that we're not dwelling too long with these people, but oh, it's also very here. quick, but it worked very I well. You'll come back and visit again. You can meet Seiko. I mean, you can meet Shinichi's mother. What? Yeah, that's a no, crucial element that we're missing here. I plan on becoming a kindergarten or elementary school teacher someday soon. Do you happen to have a plan B? Huh? <laughs> You're not quite cut out to be a teacher. Yep. That's true. Yeah, organization-wise, she's not Look there. Look at all of Yuiko's injuries. Uh, you have them do dangerous things. Plus, you can't discipline them. Not exactly teacher material, I'd say. But scrapes <laughs> and bruises are part of growing up. And besides, yeah, but you don't. You want to try to lessen them it, no, as much friend. as you can. I don't think she's a teacher. <sighs> she's just not organized. There was a teacher like Nodami. The kids would tease her and not take her seriously. True. The PTA wouldn't stand for that. Well, I mean, there is some the bull crap being said here, amazing. too, but... It was really cool. So I think you should work on your piano playing instead of being a teacher. Yes, that's as a, as a teacher and as someone who has taught kindergarten, it, it, I think it would be a yeah, shame it's... if that were to go to waste. Don't you agree, my dear? 
I there's, there's a lot of elements that Nodami is missing. I'm going to be a teacher. I mean, she still has studying to do, if so parent, she can still learn sure some of these skills. My child was transferred out of your class. Okay, that's okay. We're not necessarily hitting hard here. Fine, go, go. I think first we should take a look at what members we can expect and the different parts we need. Oh, actually, yeah, so we know what kind of pieces we can program. We need to know what our instrumentation is going to be. Wow, quite a few names here. I guess we've got a new string. My friend Mine got in the A orchestra. Oh, nice. Hey, Mine. I was gonna. I was wondering, like, if we, did we kind of drop that, or is he gonna come back? Cause I want to know, like, which cast members end up hanging Isn't around. Is Ito that guy that hits with a paper fan? Mm-hmm. Uh huh. It's gotta be because my teacher is Mr. Tanioka. She's right. I think you must have got her mixed up with someone else. Quit fooling around. And there it goes. Oh no. Now I will make it blossom into the sunlight. Be grateful. Very well, the lesson begins. Did she just develop chicken pox or now, hives? Let's start by having you play what you were last working on. How the frizzy tree whispers to her, there's a storm Well, uh, is it like, I, I don't know what this Stop. is. What, what the heck was that uh, song? Just play a normal piano piece, all right? Wasn't this normal? I mean like Chopin. Really? Just something everyone knows. Oh, something everybody knows. Or at least something of the repertoire so we can better get it. Really? Or at least, you know, something that you can get a better judgment of her skill. Why can't you play like you're told? Hmm. Though. This is not a nursery school. It is a music university. What's more, you are my student. I chose you. Got it, busy? There'll be no playing around. Yeah. I mean, yeah, but it, it, I and I get what she's getting at, but I mean, if we want to develop more skills, there are things to challenge and work up to. Things to work up to and pose more challenge to help hone, uncover deficiencies, and improve your skills. Why does she sound incredibly congested? should probably make a smaller paper fan. Or you should not hit people in general. the student is, I vowed not to give up on them. No, it's wrong! Hayden! No, I say it's Mendelssohn! Why did you say Hayden? She said she... Suddenly it's all coming back to me. I like that one. In just 30 minutes. Just long enough for the liquor to kick in. I second that! Baller Symphony of a Thousand! No, hey, no. Are you serious? Listen, Chiaki, you need to I have a full multiple choruses for that. Yeah, and we just did that with, I'm or attempted to do that with Mozart in the Jungle. At least there's someone here who's sensible. On the show too. Besides, no flute. A flute concerto, right? No. Like hell you will. Don't think you can just decide this on your own. Though actually, the instrumentation probably would lend itself well to that. It has to be thinner. A Hindman. Who's that? Who? How do you not know who can do this? There's ways to go with a violin concerto. And I'll be soloing. No! The wedding. Aside from me. Well, yeah. I mean, they're all. Even though they're orchestra players, I mean, they all are pursuing solo careers, and that's why they got into that. The spirit of adventure. No one like auditions to be just an orchestra person, or at least. Ooh. With karaoke. Okay. I love how low-key it is. It's like, okay. No drama there. Who here is ready to go bar hopping? Yeah! I like her. She's hey, cool. Chiaki. You coming with us? Huh? Oh, uh, yeah, sure. They seem like okay, a cool bunch. Cool, right. And I like all these sudden bursts of new characters we're getting into this show. Even... Even though we still got quite a bit of ways left to go, I mean, this show's gone through with some pretty nice arcs already. I'm interested in hearing a lot more performances with this orchestra, especially because we're not dealing with all the stress I'm on or the struggling player antics. They do seem to be happy more on their games, so hopefully this means more performances or at least um, like bigger features of the performances because hopefully we're getting like a higher level of playing out of this. 
And yeah, it was really nice to see how quickly we resolved all that stuff with Chiaki's family. I was worried that, you know, is this going to be our next, like, arc that we're sticking around there for a while. But no, we resolved it pretty quickly and cleanly with, like, you know, they listen to the music, starts turning around. I mean, it was a little cliche, but, um... Okay, so she's talking, I think it was the oboe guy. Maybe he'll kindle something in her with, like, his different attitude and perspective with his own very chill attitude there. But, um, what was I going to say? Oh yeah, like how everything turned around quickly at Chiaki's home. Um, maybe they'll come back. I don't know, I could stand to see those characters again. Especially, yeah, we still need to meet his mother. So yeah, I'll see you again for No Dame Cantabile, episode 16. I'm Joe Phonium, my name is Joe, and I play the Euphonium. See ya! Happy playing! Hey, did you like that video? Well, I've got more. Right now, I'm reacting to three shows. Mozart in the Jungle, Nodame Cantabile, and Your Lie in April. If you haven't seen any of those before, click the videos to start at the first reaction. New reactions get posted every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And check out some of the other stuff I have on my channel too. Enjoy, and happy playing!